Hi, my name's Will, um, and I'm from Loughborough, and um, I'm here to talk about um, adoption for gay and lesbian people. My partner and I adopted her son two years ago now. For gay and lesbian people, it's just being aware that you can um, adopt and foster, um, and it's something that, I mean, for myself, I hadn't really considered it greatly until I was in a stable long-term relationship, but, you know, I just... I just felt that I was ready to share my my life um, and our life with with a, a child and having a child and making a family. So um, I just think it's um, that awareness needs to be out there that um, that gay and lesbian people can um, adopt and foster. And um, and we've had nothing but sort of support from Quorum, who the agency went through, and our local community and friends and family have just really supported us throughout the whole process. I suppose that there is probably that people do probably still have that um, stigma. I think people probably sort of might worry about what other people might think or say. And, you know, and I think when we went through the process, one of the key things that, that our agency, that Quorum gave us was about, are you good enough to be a parent? And I think many people go through adoption and think, oh, I have to be the perfect, the perfect couple, the perfect person to adopt. And actually it's in the end it's like are you good enough to be a parent can you offer a child um a home and if you can it's you know there is a child out there that would love a home so i think it's making that more and um, people more aware of that you know that, that people can go ahead and uh, adopt and foster uh, for our situation our family um we haven't looked back since adopting and i just couldn't imagine sort of my life without my son now and I think for anybody sort of even considering it is just to go and find out about it, find some information out about it with Quorum that we went through they were just I mean it was very much what do you want to know and, and giving it they, they gave us all the information that we needed and we sort of asked we asked 101 questions and none of those questions were silly questions it was just so they really allayed our sort of um, our fears about about going down the sort of the adoption route, and throughout the whole process, I mean, it, it's what we wanted was something that was very open and transparent, and and that's something that we certainly got back. That you know, if there were any issues, I think we just wanted to know about them um, throughout from from start to finish. It was a very positive um, sort of process that we went through.